I'll look at that. <laughs> okay. Nice. Right. Uh, <laughs> well, you. Here I am. We did it. Where what that thing was. Yup. Where's that key? No, no, it was no, it was on the next floor. Like you're you're where the monster, the glowing red monster was. Oh yeah. yeah. Now you can go up or down. We'll see. The it's wacky way adventures yeah. of James. Oh, you can go up. No, yeah. Sorry, I was like uh, looking at the chat. Uh, nope. Shit's locked. I just want a mod that just says it shits lock, bro. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, I'm I'm one hundred percent stealing the shits locked joke from but two best friends play. Oh, is it? Okay. Yeah. Also, uh, he was looking at something on the ground. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Silent Hill. No, the first game is like really it's really oppressive like this one it's very calm like i'm not really as because that game like especially the soundtrack and all the stuff it throws at you it makes you it's just very hectic and it's just in your face yeah no absolutely it's more aggressively on your face in your face yeah this, this game this game is not as doesn't go nearly as hard at least no not yet. but it's on purpose it's somber that's for sure yes <laughs> God. That honest to God scared me. God, he's so perfect here. I love it. Kind of happy that for the sake of the cutscene, James just found a clip. No, oh, no, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> this way, we don't have to justify using actual bullets from your inventory. Right. God, I haven't been scared by a cutscene in a while. <laughs> it kind of happens out of nowhere. Uh, also, go back to the. Um... The, cl the closet he was hiding in, because I think he was looking at something. Yep. Nice. Fort Yarrow. Alright. Sick. Yep. Counter! Yeah. Oh, you can go get the yeah. key now. What? Oh, you yeah. Can... Yeah. Right. Uh, no, the other way. Yeah, I know. I just look at oh, yeah, yeah. over here. But That's I might as well. I mean, yeah, we're, we're close, so. There you go. Fire escape. Alright. Nice. Yeah, let's check what's in here. Yeah, let's see what's in the 
We got three rooms, three possibilities. Also, this one. Go go inside. Let's see what what's in there. No, I mean. Uh... I'm here now. Just like Neil Breen. How's my health doing? Uh, wrong button. Oh. Yeah, you should heal. Yeah. Yeah, okay. How's it going? Come on, baby. You're as soon as I get in there, he's gonna spew on oh, me. Oh yeah, you you can see him strategizing. He has. Oh, there you go. He had a plan, and that plan was successful. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh. You you won the battle, but he won against your spirit. God, yeah, right. <laughs> Tech me so hard. Yeah. <laughs> He he's baited me. He's laughing at you from the other side. <laughs> Just Christ. Thank you for all the bullets. Okay. Uh, by the way, check the map for a sec. I want to see something. Okay, right next to the stairs, there's a room you didn't check. You should go see what's in there. Uh, the, the small room, yeah. Ah. You doing okay? Yeah, yeah it's just a. Uh, it's a. This game is so quiet. It's like really soothing at the same time. Oh yeah. Like I said, the first game like really is oppressive. It really, like when I played that, I remember just frantically, just being anxious throughout that entire game. No. Especially the latter. Oh no, yeah, like uh, for the first game and the third game go for some different moods. Like there are people who legitimately like one over the other, mm. and I can see why. Yeah. Uh, nothing. I just got some handgun bullets. Was that it? Mm, yeah. No. Okay. Because I was I I don't remember what a specific item is, and I was unsure if it was in there. But yeah, just two more rooms, and then we can go to the courtyard. Oh, there you go. Oh, the... Okay, yeah. The door was walled off. James Wacky Adventures. Oh, this is closed. Shit's locked. Ah, there you go. Juice. Yep. <laughs> yep, there you go. Okay, so here's my suggestion. Mm -hmm. uh, go back to the second floor. Alright. Like, I'm just gonna tell you what the uh, solution is on this one because it's kind of obtuse, but do you remember the the thing that is um, stuck in the trash chute. Yes. Okay. You need. You need. No. Oh, you. No. 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 Go down. Go down. Sorry. Go down. I go back to the first floor. Uh, basically, you need something heavy to get the thing inside the chute unstuck. And the answer is the cans of juice, which is not the most straightforward solution. Yeah, I did it. Yeah, 
There we go. Okay, second. Here we go. In the first or second floor? Uh, second, second. Go to the second first. Yeah, we're gonna finish that specific puzzle and then we can go to the courtyard, which is at in the on the first floor. Yep, there you go. Right, right. There we go. God, how do you know to do this? Yeah, I know. This is, like there are two specific puzzles that are kind of obtuse, and I will just tell you on on those two. Honestly, and this is the honestly, first one. <laughs> honestly, it the puzzle would make a little bit more sense if he mentioned it feels heavy. Yeah, uh, I took a quick glance at the description, and it doesn't say anything, but still. <laughs> Um, like, ah, oh, canned juice seems more like trash. Feels yeah, no, heavy, I, though. <laughs> yes. I uh, wonder if... And the next puzzle, the, the next obtuse puzzle is actually worse, that's the issue. I got a coin. Cool. The police announced today that Walter Sullivan, who was arrested on the 18th of this month for the brutal murder of Billy Locaine and his sister Miriam, committed suicide in his jail. I can't believe this. How could you in his jail or cell earlier on the morning of the 22nd? How could you commit suicide? According to, <laughs> according to the police statement, Sullivan used a soup spoon to stab him. Oh my god. Like, that's not blunt. That... Yeah, no, that takes effort. Ser severing his carotid ar ar artery. By the time the guard discovered him, Sullivan was dead from blood loss. The spoon buried two inches into his neck. Wow, he got a good ways in there. Mm -hmm. An old schoolmate of, Sol of Walter Sullivan's from his hometown of Pleasant River said, he didn't look like the type of guy who'd kill kids. But I do remember that just before they arrested him, he was blurting out all sorts of strange stuff like he was trying to kill me, he's trying to punish me, the monster, the red devil. Forgive me, I did it, but it wasn't me. The schoolmate then added, I guess now that I think of it, he was kind of crazy. <laughs> okay, so, do you want to hear the funniest part about what you just read? Yeah, let's hear it. Walter Sullivan is the main antagonist of Silent Hill 4. Sweet, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and yeah, you can go to the courtyard now. Where's the courtyard? This way. In the door. Get in the door. Yes. The door on the first floor. Here. Yeah. This one. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Explore. Oh, you should check the swimming pool. Have a good night, Spirulina. Bye. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. you can just run down, get whatever it's in the in the carrier, and ju just get out. Alright. There you go. The, the cart. Oh, oh, the cart. Oh. Come on. <laughs> I got it. Yep. Whatever it was, I got it. Get oh. out, get out, get out. <laughs> yeah, from the same, yeah, from the same way you got in. And done. And done, okay. We did it. Oh, uh, they set it up like that on purpose. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. Okay, let's check the map. We have doors to check. We have one door. Singular. Well, and we have more doors inside, so... No. <laughs> Just no. <laughs> Oh, hi, Mark. Yeah. Oops. Yeah. 
Come on. Come on. You can There's win. There's really no winning that. Oh, no, yeah. You just gotta know the timing. There you go. It's hard to get timing down right now. Oh, yeah, you're right. Like, oh, God. That scared me. Behind you. Yep. Here. Check it. Oh, yep. hello. Stuff happened. God, that's like... Oh, I hate that sound. It's like wet and chunky. Ah, <laughs> uh, stop. Ugh, stop. James. James Sunderland. Um, Eddie. Eddie. He, lo he looks like a Christian to me. <laughs> I didn't do it. I didn't do it. He was like that when I got here. I didn't do it. I didn't rape my mother. Friends with that. Hmm. Oh, pyramid head. Hmm. <laughs> I'll be super right. He's the kid from Shrek 4. The what? Oh, uh, you know the kid from Shrek 4 who was like, do the raw. Uh, do the raw. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that one. Well, I guess this place isn't too safe either. What happened here anyway? Uh, I, I told you, I don't know. I'm not even from this town. I just, I just... You too, huh? Something just brought you here. Dude, like, how much could you possibly throw? Like, th soon there's, like, nothing yeah, left. You could say that. I actually have a funny story about that. Well, Please, by all means. Not when we're done with the cutscene. I think you better get out of here soon. Well, yeah, you're right. What about you? I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. Eddie, be careful. James, I, I, um, you be careful, too. <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> okay, so basically, originally, this scene was actually worse, like, more disgusting. Mm. But after they recorded this, the, uh, the original scene, a blackout made them lose everything. And they mm. took it as a, as a sign from God to tone it down to what it is now in the final game. <laughs> it was me, I didn't do it. Uh, <laughs> I swear. James is taking out taking cover. <laughs> it becomes, also, it I becomes also... a fucking scary movie scene. Yeah. Also, I heard like a little bit of an inflection in his voice when he said uh I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. He sounded a little bit menacing. A little bit what? Sorry. He sounded a little menacing there when he said. Oh, oh, oh well, yeah. He said, "I'll I'll leave as soon as I'm done here." He kind of switched up his tone. Yeah. Come on, let me look at it. <laughs> There he is. Uh, get out of my house! I'm sick of this. Ooh. I'm sick of it. Oh, thank God this game tells you. Ah, uh, you should use more than one, yeah? Okay. Okay. There you go. Good. Hopefully there's more. Oh, he's looking. Oh, and gun. Nice. Yeah. 
Sorry I'm not like talking too much folks. Normally I have a lot at least a little bit more to say, but I'm like so focused right now. Oh yeah. Also this is a good game, so yeah, not this really level, like this level is not the best, but fortunately it's the technically the worst part of the game. So. I'm not exactly seeing the spectacular badness of this No, level. it's no no no, I mean by comparison. It's because like on your own, like this level has the issue that like the progression is not entirely clear and half of the progression is stopped by triggers. I've been influencing you to do stuff in a specific order to make sure you don't get stuck. Okay, thank yeah, you. Yeah, like I'm actually like helping you, but in a very subtle way. I didn't even notice, so yeah. You're yeah, no, that. because like, here's the deal. Last time I streamed this game, uh, I remember this game almost by memory, but the issue mm -hmm. is that I didn't know that this section was stopped if you didn't do specific stuff in the right order. So I no, okay. I got stuck twice. So I guess we gotta go stairs. Yo. Oh, you have uh, a key for the fire escape um, oh, that's right. stairs. Yeah, we need, I, we need to go that first. Yeah, we need to go that next. And yes, you uh, second floor. You're right. Yep. There you go. Uh, check your map. Uh, go down, go left. There you go, that's the fire escape. Uh, oh, 201? Yeah, to, next to 201, yes. 202? No, 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 it's literally next to the door, 201. It's, uh, like, check your map real quick. Uh, next to uh, 201. Do you see that uh, other locked door? Yeah, there you go. Okay, this whole bit right here. Yes. Also, you should save, just to be sure. Oh, he's looking at something in the kitchen. There we go. How many of those do I have? Let's see. Only I three. three. One, ten. Man, in the first song of the whole game, I might have gotten ten of those by now. Uh, this is not the right door. Uh, this is the clock room, so you need to go through the hole in the do in the wall. There you go. What? What? Why is the sound so worse? Oh, that's right. You know, I'm just gonna let that play out. <laughs> God. And there we go. Jesus. What up, Paul? Someone knocked on my door. <laughs> you wanna you wanna pick that up? Yeah, I'm gonna take care of that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Perfect. That's the kind of spooks we want. David. Yeah? So, uh... I think we're gonna have to call it for now. Oh, uh, this is- this is it? Huh? Uh, we, we're gonna stop for today. Yeah, we're gonna stop right here. Uh, I think it's okay, good. a shame. We were almost done. <laughs> All right. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, don't worry. Okay, so we. I uh, know it saved the game. Yeah, through the pause menu. There you go. 
Okay, so we will continue eventually because next week uh, I'm not sure but the next one probably so for now have a good day everyone. Bye